The Fontan procedure is a staged palliative cardiac surgical intervention performed in pediatric patients with complex congenital heart defects characterized by a single functional systemic ventricle. Following this hemodynamic correction, the systemic ventricle supports systemic circulation, while the hypoplastic ventricle is non-functional. Venous return to the pulmonary circulation occurs passively, bypassing the right ventricle and its pump function through cavopulmonary connections established by the Glenn and Fontan anastomoses. This physiology results in chronic systemic venous congestion. The pathophysiological cascade leading to the development of protein-losing enteropathy begins with sustained elevation of central venous pressure, impairing lymphatic drainage via the thoracic duct. This triggers a series of pathological changes, including lymphatic vessel dilation, the formation of lymphangiectasia, and the development of abnormal lymphatic collaterals, particularly in the hepatoduodenal region. At the intestinal level, these changes manifest as dilatation and thinning of the walls of lymphatic capillaries lacteals within the intestinal villi, ultimately resulting in structural compromise and leakage of protein-rich lymph into the intestinal lumen. Clinically, this pathological process presents as severe protein-losing enteropathy, characterized by profound hypoalbuminemia, generalized edema, and malnutrition. Management of these patients necessitates a comprehensive, multidisciplinary approach involving cardiology, gastroenterology, nutrition, and, when indicated, surgical intervention.